Good day everyone, and today we're going to be talking about the Iron Kin of the Votan. So, let's get started on that. Before we get into the nitty gritty of this video, if you could like and subscribe, that really helps me out. So, the Iron Kin. They are a blasphemous AI type of individual, and they are a sentient AI in a, a robotic shell. Now, it mentions in the article that they are helpers and they've always been with the Rotan. They've always been with the kin. Iron kin are equals in society. So they are sentient robots that are equals in society. Now if we look at the design of the model that we see here, and I'll put the picture on the screen for you, they are very similar to a couple of things. They are very similar to the UR model from Blackstone Fortress and they are very similar to the Admech uh, robots, the Castalian robots. Because, let's face it, the Votan are using an ST construct to create these individuals. And we don't know how much of the past the Votan went from Earth, how, how far ago. Because if we look at a couple of possibilities, number one, they went before the Robotic Rebellion, where the galaxy had to unite to destroy them. This is basically going back to a point of time where Warhammer was very influenced by Dune and you can see the similarities because of like distrust in um, technology computers and that type of thing is present in both universes. However, however, the profane AI of the Votan, the Votan themselves and these robots, these Ironkin, makes me think that there is two possibilities. And the first one is they went before the AI Crusade and the second one is they went after the AI Crusade and some AIs decided to band together, create the Votan people or the kin and hardwire in them to treat AIs as equals basically. We don't know how far they go back and these reveals are asking more questions than the answering and it's an interesting time because if we see him here and he's got an iron like body but he's also got a leather apron with lots and lots of tools and he's got like a backpack as well and he's holding a wrench and some sort of like weird nail gun maybe i have no idea what that is but it looks like a nail gun and he's also got like a hose but the the thing i want to point out is he doesn't have tools built into his hand like you'd expect a robot to do no he has an apron and he has normal hands and little gloves little gloves by the way and he takes tools out of his apron and he uses them like normal people he doesn't have tools in his hand i, I want people to understand this that this robot is very different to probably the servitors and stuff that the um, advent use because they would basically build a and a service school with a screwdriver or they'd have an attachment to one of their mechanandroids as a screwdriver no 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 nonsense like that with the Votan they all have an ironkin who has an apron who just has all the tools and he'll work on it himself now also mentions that they are faking emotions but they probably can understand them to some degree and it also mentions that they're navigators because they can compute stuff to dodge around warp stones. So they don't need like a, a navigator with a psychic gene. They just have these iron kin who are able to plot it with their mechanical brains or technical brains. It also mentions that they are wayfinders, uh, which they're the navigators, of course. And they also pilot. So all the ships, like fighters and stuff, are piloted by robots. Probably because they have faster reaction times, because the Votan are an engineered people to survive on these planets with high gravity and they fill a certain niche. So they don't need to be quick reacting, whereas the robots perhaps do, and that's where they fill in the gaps of them not being as fast as other races. They use these Iron King to supplement that gap. It also mentions their shock troopers, and it also mentions that they have smaller cog robots and it has a picture which i'll put on the screen for you which again looks a bit like the iron kin but looks a bit different he's got like thrusters and he's carrying some sort of like rock so there might be levels of robots into the rotan people themselves also it corroborates that list it says that the men of iron were returning this is very men of iron in some people's opinion in my opinion we don't know yet we don't know if they went before we don't know if they were created after or during that war or or what have you uh, hopefully we'll have some news about that fairly soon or 
closer towards the date of release of course so that's it really that's the little article that i wanted to talk about yes it is significantly later than most people's and i'm sorry about that uh, due to some roadworks and stuff so thank you all for your time i'm tricks and you're you and that's been the latest about 10 news we will talk more about perhaps his weapons and armor in another video perhaps we will talk about a few other bits and pieces in another video thank you again for your time take care of yourselves bye bye